first PTI instigated violence and chaos on the 9th of May, and now when they are exposed, they are polluting the masses, through their fake propaganda videos. Let's expose PTI lies from this video. And who is this mysterious man which instigated the crowd to enter the house? Let me tell you who is this man. In video, a man is falsely accused to be a famous Karachi-based social media influencer Nauman Khan. Once this allegation was exposed, they started naming him Lieutenant Colonel Tanvir of intelligence agencies, but their propaganda met the same fate. However, in actual, he is a hardcore PTI activist Imran Mehboob whose timeline is full with IK's photos and posts. Imran Mehboob is in custody of law enforcement agencies on the charges of vandalism and pending trial. PTI leader Dr. Yasmi Rashid can be clearly heard urging the crowd against from entering the house. Once you call a mob at a place, instigated them, then it becomes your responsibility to control them. First you planned, charged up supporters through series of hate speeches, instigated to reach at places, and now trying a cover up. उनका घर रहन सहक कर दिया कोई गमले से लेके घर की कोई चीज बाकी नहीं बची बिल्कुल उसको तबाह कर दिए उड़ा दिया why was the crowd not stopped at any of the checkpoints in the cantonment area? 2. Who ordered the removal of the multi-layered security detail from the Corps Commander's house? 3. Why was there no response from Quick Response Force and Garrison Security Force despite the fact the Corps Commander's house was under attack for many hours? The argument raised give insights into perverted mindset of IK. It's like a murderer defending on the plea that why was he allowed to murder and not stopped. So, here are the answers to their conspiracies. In civil riot scenarios, army is placed at third tier response. Charged up crowd is never stormed up in spur of moment. We have examples of Capitol Hill and London riots. Despite all the state machinery at place, Capitol Hill was vandalized, as you don't shoot your own people. While, there were intelligence reports that fascist PTI party, is trying hard to put army against their own people. However, IK desperately wanted blood of civilians, through military bullets, to keep his politics thrive on anti-establishment agenda. Being a professional military, Pakistan army avoided direct confrontation, against its own people. This was a well-planned, orchestrated and coordinated attack unleashed on 200 places across Pakistan like GHQ, MES Office Lahore, Corps Commander House, Askari Towers Lahore, Miawali, Multan, Gujrawala, Timagara, Sawat, Mardan, Quetta, Rangers Post at Karachi and Abbottabad to name the few. Protesters were given the target to rally the crowds and had three layered tactics. 1. The leaders rallied to pre-arranged targets from different locations. 2. The women were used as vanguards to stern the responses cause as per social norms women are not met with force. And once they were unable to limit the distance from law enforcement agencies, men armed to teeth, fired indiscriminately. Who benefits from the chaos? Since his first day of politics, IK has always remained the agent of chaos. Remember 2014, when PTI vandalized government properties, including PTV building. In his recent speeches he has been inciting and reasoning the riots to be just full. 
आपको बताना चाहता हूं कि इन्होंने पूरा प्लान बनाया हुआ है मुझे अरेस्ट करने का बीस हजार लोग सड़कों से काटते हो तो जनरल का पेशाब निकल जाएंगे बीस हजार लोग सड़कों से काटते हो तो जनरल का पेशाब निकल जाएंगे He repeated the same barbarianism on the 25th of May 2022. Vandalizing, burning government properties and creating state of chaos in complete country, putting economic activities on hold. Thodi si police hai. Hazar hai 1, 70000 80000 kitni hai. Aapne ye khauf ke put ko todna and it was all illegal. कहा है इमरान खान ने कहा है कि मैं आपको तमाम सूरत हाल ऐसी आगाह कर रहा हूँ अगर दोबारा गिरफ्तार किया तो फिर वही रद्द अमल आएगा IK planned and executed the 9th of May chaos for his benefits, but this time destiny had other plans. जिस तरह मुझे कमांडो एक्शन से उठाया गया तो उसका रिएक्शन किधर जाना था जिससे मिलिट्री सिंबल है उसके बाद इधर जाना था ना If they think they'll sit quietly and do nothing, if uh, they uh, shall be in jail, there would be a reaction. But you know that does sound to many like a threat. Well, I didn't make the threat. It's the it's the workers and the uh, and the party members. जो भी मुझे पता चला है कि तकरीब कारों को बीच में डाला गया बंदूकें लेके उन्होंने लोगों को इस्तेमाल दी. It's the workers and the uh, and the party members. Can't then say that you are not partly responsible for whipping up an environment in which people were aggressive and violent on the streets. When was it not peaceful? Tell me. I I was out in Islamabad with people who were speaking passionately about supporting you, but were also using slingshots, throwing stones, holding very large sticks against the police. There are videos of your supporters who were part of the crowd, part of the group. that were burning down military buildings it's not true it's not true it's the workers and the uh, and the party members and at the end may i ask how come ik handler zalmay kalalzad tweets the same night demanding resignation of army chief was it also on establishment's request mr imran khan you can fool some people some time but you can't fool all the people all the time Pakistan's Indabad